was a great season. Um, you look, you look at the look at the numbers, see the goals scored, goals conceded. Um, you know, the results certainly don't lie, is, is is the old saying. And to you know go through a season, albeit slightly short, with with just one defeat, um, you know, is 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 a really it's a really great thing. It's a it's a great achievement. Uh, certainly, certainly in my first season, and with you know primarily. Um, you know, a, a new group and a new team that had come together, and it was you know really exciting to see the the way they they grew stronger and stronger as as the season went on. So, yeah, look, delighted with you know with with the outcome, and uh, as I said, just to lose only, only one game a season, you know, I think highlights just how hard and, and high high the boys uh, worked this season. The new players that came in hit the ground running, um, and you know something I was keen to bring in this year was. You know, an added sense of um, you know speed, intensity, uh, aggression with with how we played with the ball, especially you know through the thirds with with that control possession, but with you know real in, uh, attacking intent and mentality, and you know the, the the quality of the group and the quality of the individuals that started the season and came in halfway through, you know, only adds to. You know the, the the weapons and and the and, and the quality and, and the way that we were able to you know live those values day in day out. So yeah, look, certainly I think the, the way that the the, the group behaved on a, on a daily basis basis and um, their their intensity and their appetite to, to be better every day um, certainly for me a, a big standout and one of the you know one of the, the keys to our success this season. You saw early on that you know some of the results were were quite open. They were they were quite varied. There was a few certainly a few a few shocks week to week. Um, you know to, to keep things interesting and and look if you look right up until the last last game um, where, where the league ended. You know I think mathematically there were you know still three to four teams battling for that final playoff spot. If I had to single you know some people out, I think firstly um, you know Connor Tracy in goal. Continued his his fine growth and development from having a strong season, you know, last year at Canterbury, and I was keen to you know bring him into the club both for uh, you know to to push someone of the likes of uh, you know in Yount Zubi Karai and obviously look a little bit longer term, but you know Connor took his opportunity and certainly didn't look back, and I, I thought he was I thought he was excellent. Um, I think another player. You know, he's uh, who, who, who I think grew into the season and, and got stronger as we went was was Brian Kaltak. Um, again, someone who's obviously been at the club a couple of years, knows knows the league and and the country, and I think he's someone with you know an incredible amount of talent and you know has still got a lot of development to come, and, and I think he, he certainly got got a bright future at the club. You know, I can't I can't say enough for for the guys that led the team. Uh, um, you know, the likes of you know Angel Balanga, Mario Billen, Albert Riera, who play you know huge, huge leadership roles on and off the pitch. I thought you know when they played, they were you know absolutely outstanding and, and showed their quality. And, and one of our you know younger leaders and captain at times, Cam Howison, who you know again I think you know highlighted he's he's definitely one of one of the top top players in the league and. You know, I guess I think if you're looking at stats, um, obviously Maya Bevan taking out the, you know, the, the, the golden boot for this season um, is obviously probably a, an obvious one to pick, and you know, someone that I'd worked with a number of years ago as a as a spring chicken when he was 15, 16, and I was delighted that he, he wanted to join the club and, and that he, he showcased, um, you know, exactly, you know, why he's. You know, he's, uh, he's 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 a player that's certainly knocking on the door for for the All Whites and, and bigger things. So, yeah, look, there's there's a few names to mention, but again, I just I want to reiterate that you know none, none of this could have happened without without the efforts of of the whole group uh, day in day out.